Warning, do not attempt to move on to the next step before you are confident, comfortable, and relaxed with the previous step. I prescribe practicing three days a week for maximum results. So, I see you've come back to the swim doctor's office because you're having trouble with the backflow. Well, luckily I have the perfect remedy for that. So, the first thing you want to uh, remember is with the back float, it might seem a little scary at first, but it is all in your head. So if you've done my previous tutorials, I know for a fact that you can do a back float. So you might need a little bit of pointers and I'm gonna give you a few uh, great tips for how to do the back float if you're by yourself. So first thing you're gonna need is a kickboard. Now I'll have a link to that in the description below. Uh, check those out, make sure you get one of those. Kickboards are, you need them. Everybody needs them in the pool, um, whether it's for a workout or just practicing. So uh, we're gonna be working on the practicing part. Uh, now the first thing you want to do is get into the pool, obviously, and uh, with your kickboard you're going to hug it. So you're going to grab both ends of it and you're just going to hug it in the water. Um, now what you're going to do is you're going to slowly start laying back. Now you want to do this very gently because if you just fall back, uh, you're going to go underwater and if you're already a little bit afraid of your head going under the water, uh, this is going to be pretty freaky for you. So my remedy would be slowly going back into the water. Um, now the kickboard is going to help you stay afloat, um, which you can already float if you've done my previous tutorials. You can already float. This is just to give you a little bit of reassurance. So once you do it a couple times, just uh, let go of the kickboard. Once you feel more confident and comfortable in the water, um, you're gonna wanna take the kickboard away. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the uh, backflip. Next video, I'll be going over how to do the kicking. Uh, stay tuned for that. Um, make sure you leave a like and you subscribe and you turn on those bell notifications so that you know the next time I upload a video.